hi guys this is lillian i'm here to take you on a food tour so i went to a chinese restaurant to eat the chinese hot pots it's called huo guo in chinese huo guo so we ate the chinese hot pot i've always been longing to eat the chinese hot pot so the chinese hot pot is a meal where you boil everything in a pot right the pots get sizzling you just keep boiling uh, raw meat you boil your vegetables and all so here we went to the hot pot restaurant at oriental hotel we go to the third floor uh it has a very nice view the place is really nice so once you enter on the third floor is on your left yeah so and then um it has a very nice view a sea view we had to go on time so that we could sit close to the view right where you could just see the water you could see the boats and all that so it's really something i i actually enjoyed so like here you could see the boats passing through and you could just have a nice view and even there are some other restaurants down there as well you could also be looking at while eating right so and then one thing about the huogo you have to get your uh, vegetables you have to get your ingredients these are the ingredients the vegetables that you add to it you also have to get your soup you use your soup this is the soup you use to boil your meat then you also get your the meat itself or the yeah here's where you get the plate and then you go get the meat I had to go for um, the meatball yeah I had to go for the meatball I had to go for the beef the goat meat as well and then um, they had all sorts of meat actually like anyone you want to just go serve yourself nobody's going to ask you to get within your limits you just get as much as you want the hot dogs is there there are so many for those that like different meats you could just ask the attendants there to actually direct you on what meats you want okay and then after that i had to go for the vegetables they have different vegetables there they even have yam potato that you boil in that soup right they even have the noodles the chinese noodles and all so for those the lovers of chinese you could actually uh, yeah i got a sushi as well this was my first time eating sushi yeah i also got one sushi here it was actually very very nice guys so you have to try it out so when i was done with this then i have to boil the boil the what's it called the soup because the soup is uh, is cold so you just have to set it so there's this um there's this uh, what's it called yeah uh what's it called it's an automatic you just turn it on and then it just starts uh boiling the soup you just make it hot just like a, uh, a stove or something yeah so this is the mix um the ingredient that i mix together then the meat then the vegetables so once the soup starts boiling you just start putting everything inside right you just start putting everything inside allow it to cook because i have seen so many comments here asking me oh you're eating a raw meat please i did not eat any raw meat at all so once like you can see once the soup starts boiling you just start putting everything so i had to go for the pepper soup there are so many other people that also go for the other one so this soup has pepper inside because i actually love pepper so you just start putting in this it's not a a plain soup they already have the ingredients and all inside it so you're not mixing any other ingredients so what you just do is you boil the meat you boil the yam you boil the potato everything you boil it inside like as i'm doing here right now for those that can't use the chopstick they can also give you uh other cutlery to use based on your own preference right so when it's done boiling you just start eating okay no wasting of time at all so like you can see right here it's boiling right if you check the meat it's already looking all cooked and all and the the meat was sliced very in a tiny way so that the water could actually penetrate when you're boiling it won't be too hard for you to cook it okay so like you can see here is actually well boiled then you mix it with your own ingredient the one you mix together remember at the beginning you have to mix your ingredient so when you mix everything you eat it then look at the yam like you can see is well boiled to show how soft it is already so once you confirm it's all boiled you just eat it and another thing is yeah they have other places for those that don't like chinese meal you could also try out their fried rice the suya and all that they just make it on the spot for you like you can see here they just make it and then you eat it right away thank you i hope you enjoyed my video it was actually a nice um visit
could also try coming and have some fun, eat, try out some other new dishes that you haven't tried before, okay? Life is only once, you get to live it and enjoy it. Bye!